Okay, so this is a really, really important announcement video about the current state of the channel. I mean, I have explained that I will be very busy for the college admission exam that I'll have about like 78 days ago, a days after this. On that video, on the video, on the announcement video that I had recorded about last year, it was like a a year or so so it wasn't that urgent but still i had to go on studying so yeah i had my youtube wasn't really doing that much for that let me show you so yeah announcement i don't really remember when it was the april fool stuff and so current state of this channel I did about like 18 minutes and stuff and yeah so it was about, yeah, it was, it was about a year ago, about a year, yeah, 2022, December 30th, and, yeah, well, like, those kind of stuffs and all the things I was planning, and after about, like, a year, almost two years passed, about like sleep in about 12 p.m. No, wake up in about 8 a.m. No, 6:30. Fuck. Uh, anyways, private home lesson, homeworks, and yeah, and just internet lecture done. Like mathematics, keep doing it. I mean, language about language, private lesson homeworks. My my teacher's gone to UCLA, so I'm not continuing that anymore. Sadly, but so I had to find a cram school or something. And yeah, homework and stuff. English. English was just almost perfect, so I didn't have so much problems with it. And ethics and history, internal lecture. Yeah, it's just continuing it. I haven't completed all, but I have, like, did about three times a curriculum or something. I'm now just doing some hard stuff, like, very, like, detailed parts. After I completed the detail about the intellect internet lecture explaining it about really detailed parts i will probably just go on to problem solving and just doing just solving problems and stuff anyways let's go on to it so it has 78 days that i have left until my college admission exam and well if I fail on this, I'd have another year, but I don't want to do it another year. I'd, you don't want to wait me for another year, too. I want to do so much stuff. I have so much things that I want to do. I want to learn editing. I want to just do some YouTube properly. I just, yeah, some people, So I mean, I don't, not all people, and I'm not really that famous, and not really, not much of my viewers like me, but some that I recognize really like me a lot. I mean, I'm not really sure if it's that a lot, but some like me quite a lot so for that for that people at least for that people i have to end it on this year in 78 days just for them yep yeah after it's the exact date is 2024 it november 14th on the gmt plus nine time which is korean time because i'm korean so it's so before we do the actual exam we do some kind of practice stuff practice exams as i've heard we the other foreign countries don't do practice exam as much as koreans do so ones in so in this year there was on march may june july and will be on september and october so it will be one two three four five six seven seven Seven? No, that, that, no, six. Six? Let me check. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Six practice exams. So, the March one was at the March 2018th, and I did pretty decent. Language, 78, not, it, 70 out of, 8 out of 100. It wasn't too, it wasn't too good, but it was, yeah, I got 92%. Yeah, so top 8%. I got top 8%. And mathematics, I sucked. I totally was very bad at it. Get, got like 4th grade. And 
yeah, the first is the best, and the more you go, it's more terrible. And if you are just gonna go to a fine college, you at least need to get two, yeah, the great second grade for every single subject. So I got sixty two, so that means thirty eight percent, top thirty eight percent, which is very terrible. Yeah, on I mean. The Korean standards might be too high, but you know, it's all Asian and stuff, you know, like 38% on math and English, 95, first grade and Korean history, 37, 30, 37, second grade. Those English and Korean history, they don't have the percentage rating. They don't do any like top something percent. It just only depends on what, how much score you get. But those language, mathematics and the other social study, social study, two social study subjects, you, it depends on top percent about how much you did well comparing to the other person. So this is ethics. This is ethics got second grade and top 92 so it should be eight percent not not too bad so so before explaining that I'll, I'll explain where which is the standard for first second third and fourth and stuff so uh history the world history 39 and three third grade 85 so that should be 15 percent and yep the next one was on may 8th so, yeah. So this is the grade. First, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, six, seven, eight, nine. Basically, this is A plus A, B plus B, C, D, F, F, F. This thing, you should not get it. If you study, you at least get a B. You, if you study, you at least get a B. So, first grade is up to four top four percent second grade is up to top 11 percent and third grade is up to top 23 percent and fourth grade you don't really need to care about that because normally if you want to just go to some fine and good college fourth grade you don't really want to see that on your grades on your test results even the third grade is pretty dangerous yeah, even with the third grade, you can't go to the fine, good colleges, great colleges. You just go to fine college, fine colleges. Just like I don't know what how the foreign colleges are supposed to be and how ranked they are, kind of how people think about them. So I cannot really ex say an example of it, but it's not that good. Like third grade isn't that good. So I were I weren't so good. I I mean my score was improved by how much was it by seven points but the others eventually did it really better did it good good too so i dropped down to top 19 percent and just look got located on the third grade and mathematics i improved pretty a lot even though my score didn't really improve a lot but the top percent improved pretty a lot so yeah comparing to 62 86 is a lot of improvement 24 percent of increase that is a lot of improvement i did like a top 14 percent so that is really close to top no top 14 percent yeah top 14 percent so that was really close to the getting the second grade which was top 11 percent so that was pretty close but it doesn't really matter it's a practice exam the real one matters so English 97 fine so English up to 90 score you get first grade up to 90 second grade up to 80 third grade up to 70 fourth grade up to 60 and on and on like yeah you don't really need to see under the fourth grade like yeah above fourth grade is just pretty easy you know English isn't that hard it can't be so hard because you ain't grading you ain't getting the like actual top percent with this thing so it can't be so hard but the june but the june one was intriguing like very hard
So I I it was really I anyways I uh, let's talk about that later and history history is quite similar history is first grade up to forty five or forty two I don't remember I don't remember as I remember it was like forty or something forty two first grade forty second grade thirty five or something but it doesn't really matter because it, you just have to get on I mean fourth. The fourth grade is the limit because the college doesn't doesn't give you a demerit, doesn't disadvantage you unless you get under the fourth grade. So if you're above the fourth grade, it it doesn't matter so much. It's just all fine. And the ethics pretty much a similar score. I mean, it was a, wasn't it the same score? A similar score. There's a four point increase and third grade. Third grade. So eighty two so that should be eighteen percent. So yeah, just kinda of about at the mid of the third grade. And history forty two tops third grade and top fourteen percent. Pretty similar with math. Pretty close but not wasn't not enough. But as I said, doing it great on the practice exam doesn't matter it's just an indicator of how you would do and what you should improve yeah so june was on june 4th and as i said before the english was very hard like yeah very hard it was like everybody said it was really hard and as i have experienced it like i got 85 on this thing i got like just just dropped straight i mean i dropped straight down to 85 from 97 which normally doesn't happen i just yeah the problems were way too ha way too hard considering its normal difficulties so yeah it w i hope it won't be this hard on the actual exam because they kind of messed up because the actual the well we we normally call we normally grade the first grade as top 4%, but the data said that the English, the people that got top first grade on the English test was only top 1%. So that's basically not making any sense because like, if you see it in here, it just goes like 6% and by the data, it just goes up to like, sometimes if it's too easy, it just goes up to 10%, but, but Normally up to like 6% to like 8%, top 8% gets the first grade, but this thing, this, at this practice exam, the first grade was top 1%, so it was just the total bullshit. Yeah. So anyways, so this is history, Korean history, second grade, I don't remember how much score I got, I just forgot. Language, 96, first grade. Top of a stop, top four percent reach, but I fucked up at math and just did so terribly. Got a seventy six, which I have never got. Well, I mean, it was better than this, but still a really terrible score. So I was almost, I almost could have dropped down to fourth grade, which was very terrible, but almost got it because like top twenty three. I mean, top 24% is the limit for the 4th grade, so very, very close, so I sh should have been more, I should be really studying more for more mathematics, and I, which I am literally doing right now, I'm just using all, almost all my time on mathematics, and the social studies, ethics, 92, fine, 92, fine, top 8%, fine, fine, second grade, and history world history where i'm not sure if you're actually calling it world history i'm literally translating it anyways word earth history whatever it was 86 top top i mean third grade top 14 percent pretty fine so july was on 11th and i got an 89 but i i improved as I as I remember, I did like got eighty four or something on the language on this June exam, but I got eighty nine, which I improved by five points. But 
somehow it was quite easy, so other people also improved, so I got a second grade, doing a top 9%, so that was kind of unfortunate. And mathematics, I did, I did get a little bit better. My score improved fairly a lot, like 54, 59, and now it's like 69. I'll go, no, I, anyways. I'm not sure which score I got here, but I did it really bad. I did like a 50, 51, 52 or something. I did it really bad, but I got like 69 here. I was also pretty lucky too. And, but the mathematics were just basically pretty easy. So genuinely pretty easy. So I got top 18%, third grade, English, 100, history, Korean history, 42, first grade. So yeah, it should be, yeah, it should be normally like 5%, 6% or something, but like this one is just 1%, so totally bullshit. And it did, by, I got an 85, but I immediately got above 90 and recovered to 100, so that means that my English skill was, didn't have so much problem, it was just the test, the exam being too hard. So, ethics, still similar score, 39. But also a second grade. This pretty much got a uh, top three percent lower, but top like top eleven percent, just at the limit. So it was pretty fine. But still, it's a second grade, so it's pretty fine. And history, I got a hundred. So yeah, fifty out of fifty. So that's very good. A straight one. So that was really good. And next one will be on September 2024. At this point, it is it is August 28th. I have a literal week left. I don't really feel that nervous or something. I just feel that, man, I want to do it good. I just feel that I'm not really that nervous, but I'm like kind of excited or something because I did really a lot. I put a lot of effort on the math on the vacation I like up to so my vacation started at here the July 19th and ended at August 16th and I really studied hard on math I I did like about five hours per day five hours per day every single day so that stacked up pretty a lot and I feel that I pretty much improved quite a lot like the hard questions that I struggled, hard math questions that I struggled a lot, I now can actually try to solve them, and I sometimes do solve them and get a right answer, so that is quite a lot of improvement, and if I continue this pace, I might be able to get a W on a math and get like a second grade. Second grade, like uh, mathematics, second grade, language, first grade, and like the social study second or two, I mean first or second, then I go to the college that I want. So yeah, that would be really good. So this is just seven days left and October, the October one is on 15th, Tuesday. This is this will be basically pretty easy. I mean, the red one and the blue one, it's different is that Red ones are the important ones that has more quality than the blue ones because like the red ones are the red ones are created red ones are published by the professional yeah professional institution that only that almost only specifies on creating this college admission exam and the blue ones are just basically basically done by the ministry of the education so yeah the quality difference is a lot and basically the red ones kind of indicate you red ones indicate you the probable score that you will get on the real exam so you get you get like a college admission ex like counseling that kind of counseling for college admission that ba basically all of those get are based on your weight red practice exam scores 
Well, but like the march is an exclusion. March is done by a education. I mean, Ministry of the Education. But it is quite important because it is the first ever practice exam after becoming a third grade, high school third grader. So I be, I indicated as red, even though it wasn't made by the professional institute. And there goes the 15th and the real one comes on the November 14th. And basically your result comes out like your you your result comes out in December 3rd as I remember December 3rd and you start joining colleges you start admissioning colleges let me search for a word I forgot the word I'm sorry I'm pretty bad at English join for college apply for college right apply for college so you apply for college in about like late December like late December to early early January of the next year so yeah so this is 78 days left 78 days left and I kind of feel nervous I kind of feel excited it kind of feels like really I don't know, it's kind of unrealistic that I've been running for this exact day for my middle school ages and high school ages and this is just 78 days left. This kind of feels really awkward, I'd say. Like, this kind of all feels very fantasy and just all, I don't know, it just kind of feels all dreamy and stuff. Still, this is all reality and... The real one is the real one. Even though you feel it's dreamy, you still have to put some effort on and and try to do your best. I mean, I won't do one, 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 one in everything. You know, I suck at math and language isn't like really perfect. I'm trying a lot. I'm trying to reach 98 on this one, top two percent on this one. So I'm putting quite a lot of effort on this thing too. After joining another, after joining the cram school, and mathematics was all I was always just putting quite a lot of effort on this. Well, comparing to the real, like comparing to the real top, it won't be. It will basically be nothing. But I am trying really my best, as you can see that I don't really do streams a lot. I don't really do, yes. you know. I don't really. He's literally doing some face reveal now. I don't really do streams. I don't upload videos. I just don't even say anything on the community. I don't even play games that much either. Or no, that's a lie though. I do play games quite some time, but I it decreased really a lot. So, yeah. Anyways, that's about. It about the announcement video I just hope that you know about my college ex admission exam and I will be very busy and putting all my effort onto this for the future 78 days so I hope you understand I had I hope this will help you not being so curious about my absence and not being so nervous about it so yeah that's the video and I hope to see you in 78 days so bye bye have a good day.